Hey, to welcome back everyone to board. Banjo Kazooie, oh my god, everybody! <coughs> I can't do this female cries anymore, my voice is so. Is my voice is so much better. Or worse. Nah. Uh, anyway, my voice is different. <laughs> but welcome back to play more Banjo Kazooie! I don't know why I start every single episode by saying Banjo Kazooie! It's not like if it's epic, but. Ah. Uh, it's, it's, it's cool, you know? It's cool. So. Uh, today we're gonna get some jigsaw and gonna try. Or, or rage quit for this easy part to say the least. Because this is the part of my recording section where I was like, no, nope, it's I'm not doing this anymore. Uh, seriously, this is crap. I honestly don't like. I honestly don't like Freezy Park all that much, just because of two things: ice cubes, snowmans. Oh my God, I hate these. But it does kind of fit the atmosphere though, because at the point when I'm recording this and I'm at the point where I talk over this, there, there's snow outside here in Canada, which is pretty neat. It's pretty cold, haha. <laughs> I don't even know if that was supposed to be pun or not. I just did it. But uh, it's just snowing out here and it's much better than Freezy Park. In fact, I would mind if I. W In fact, would you imagine if Freezy's Park was real with all these snowmans? People would be pissed, scared. And here I'm just gonna collect a gold feather. Oh no, I felt. <laughs> oh god. So much rage quit. And so less time. <laughs> so here I'm gonna try to jump and. Uh, I'm truly able to. So, we are forced to go back, and, oh god for sake, falling damage! <sighs> so much rage quit in so limited times. And, we're gonna go back up, and here we are, and here we're gonna take the sleigh which you need to be in the bear form, I do believe. And mumble token. Animal abuse. Oof, oof. And jigsaw. It's been a while since I did this. And he's gonna tell us to. Uh, and he's gonna tell us, and he's gonna practice for the race. But that's not important, cause we got the jigsaw pieces. We got now three. Even though we should have four, have four, yeah, uh, or something. But in fact, we're at three. What am I saying? And um, here in this episode, yeah, not gonna happen that much. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rage quit Freezy Peak at one point, and I'm gonna go back to do some stuff that I think I should have do quite a bit ago. And here's Mumbo Token. And uh, I do say that I love the fact that how did the snowball didn't hit me? I get surprised every time I record this. <laughs> um, but I was gonna say one thing, and I completely forgot. <laughs> and I completely forgot. Oh yeah, I still hate the missile attack, by the way. But um, oh yeah. Just saying this right now, you want to kill all the snowmen. I won't do this right now because, again, I'm too dumb. <laughs> so, you want to avoid missile attack every single one of them in being an evil king that will rule the land. Or some shit. So, I got a missile away. And you see, because it's so imprecise, you can't direct yourself. And that is incredibly annoying. Ah, but still, I can't gush enough. 
So here I was just jerking around for about 10 minutes and I decided to go back and see a walrus friend. Hey buddy. Uh, yeah, he's still jerking on you. I don't know why this time he does not try to flee or to hide, but... I don't know, he don't like bears. It's not everyone love bears. You know? You know? No, you probably don't. <laughs> so, because I fell and everything, I'm just gonna collect the notes. And I gotta go back in fly again. Because that's what we do. Or something. Something. <laughs> Alright, so. Taking the fly away. And here, um, that is actually a puzzle that you need to do. Um, that I should have done quite a long time ago. You need to go through the star, I do believe, while um, all the lights are on. And that's why in part 10 I rescued all of them. It's because then you gotta fly through the ring in the limited amount of time after you light them up. And I didn't understand this because, again, I am dumb. So here I'm just gonna fly and fly up and kill the scout for six snowmen. And I missed! How did I miss this? I hate you, all of you snowmans! <laughs> oh god! What? What kind of doesn't work in this is that you see these enemy snowmen, but the big snowman in the center of the map isn't moving. So let's make these moving. You didn't know, but here we got a ginger. I don't want to go for the. Or do I? Do I want to go for the? Is it the part when I? Yeah, I think this is the part when I try to get up. Yeah, I, <laughs> this is. This is definitely the part where I try to get up to this godforsaken panel. In fact, just... <laughs> I had a pretty horrible time trying to get up to this panel. In fact, in a few seconds you see how much tries I've, I've tried to get up to this godforsaken panel. Just because I'm... Just look at it. I tried, I tried, I tried, and I wasn't able to. I tried backflip, I think this, and then I tried again, because I was successfully. And here we are. I finally did it and get a Mumbo token. But I think uh, this, ch this chimney is a little too high, because it is really hard to get to this thing. And here I was at... It would, I was really close to um, failing this. But here we're gonna kill the last snowman and we're gonna get something incredible. Or completely fail. Missile attack and here we are. We have unlocked a uh, jigsaw pieces. Yeah. And then I'm just gonna fly up. Why? Because I like to spam fly or something. I don't, I don't know, I'm not good with puns, and here I missed my missile attack. How the hell did I done this? Uh, so we're just gonna fly normally. And here we are, Jigsaw. And we wasted around 30 feathers just for this. Amazing. And now we got 4 Jigsaw, which is not a lot of progress, mind you, but hey. Is something we gotta start at one point and then start all over again. I am incredibly dumb for giving morals and stuff. Oh my god! So we just gonna go and get the Jojo. Oh, excuse me. And I still have quite a bit of jigsaw, and I know quite a lot of them because again I'm too dumb I can get one from the Jinjo I can get one for the gift and here I died again <laughs> oh my god but here I'm just kind of cutting back through this thing because I was drooling around for about 10 minutes in there 
Um, he said I run a race. But, you wanna race? But you're too big and heavy for this sleigh. So, you gotta find someone smaller. We can't just go on by ourselves. Ah. So, I'm just gonna collect the notes and we gotta restart all the notes all over again, which piss me off, needless to say. And no matter what, you can't leave Kazooie alone or Banjo alone because you're too big. I don't know why, and that doesn't make any sense, because as you'll see in a couple of seconds, the way to get on this sleigh is to actually transform in your walrus form. So I get back into the Mambo's house, gonna transform, and then I'm gonna get it back. But is, isn't a walrus heavier than a bear? It's not like the walrus form is any bigger or any smaller. It's, it's not like the walrus form is any smaller. In fact, it's pretty big, if not, if not just as tall as it. Uh, so, I'm gonna accept the race, of course, which is actually the funniest thing um, so far in this world. And here I have an incredible hard time getting on this sleigh. Just for sake, jump on this guy for a second. Okay, there we go. Uh, how many trials is that? Seven? Six? What's the seven? Because it's the lucky number. So, what are you gonna do in this mini game? Is just pass through all the gates and you'll get your prize at the race. And then I gotta try it before it. So, um, tips while you're doing this. Uh, always be close to him and take as make your turns really fine, you know? And while you're on the high um, cliff, press the jump button. I, I, because I think you go faster when you jump on a hill. Because I swear, I swear, if you if you jump while you're in a hill during this this mini game on the sled, you go much, much faster. In fact jumping is the way to go in this mini game. I does that all the time, and it's pretty easy to win. You, you don't have any worries to, to lose. I mean, see how far I am, and I'm still gonna catch up to him. Here we get another mumbo token. We just gotta pass through the gates, and I still think that jumping make you a little bit faster. I mean, in yeah, here I'm gonna take advantage. I can't do. It. I want to do an animator uh, voice for a race or something. And here, jump, 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 and you get up into the hill and win the race. So, I was too quick for him. And I get my middle. Even though I'm heavier than a bear, I still can get on this tiny sleigh. And even though he is a bigger bear and hev he's a bigger and heavier bear than I, he can. He can sit on his sleigh just fine, but not me and my burn, which is smaller and lighter. You don't make any sense, game. And I like sense. Oh my god. But we have no business in the walrus form anymore. So, how about we exit? Because we have no business anymore. And this is the point where I just rage quit. Not just rage quit the level, just rage quit the game itself. Because I was just... A combination of cheap... A combination of cheap snowmen and, and stuff. And just, it wasn't fun. Quite annoying, to be perfectly honest. So... I'm just showing this up because, well, we, we've never went there before. And got some stuff between, um, not between, but beneath those webs. And I'm just here to show this thing is off. They destroyed and control the Astarlo days on toast for breakfast. 
And here we gotta go back to Mumbles Mountain because it's been quite a while since I wanted to do this. And here we go to Mumbles Mountain to finally reveal the transformation for this world. Yeah, it's about time, is it? <laughs> so, yeah, that was what I was planning all along because it's been a really long time since we went to Mumbles Mountain and it's been a really long time since we had all of these moment tokens to get the final jigsaw. So, yeah, it was about time, you know? So, let's go. Let's go right away. Even though you maybe know the transformation. And it is... A spider! Which does... Woo! Woo! When he jumps. I'm a bit smaller, but not bad for first spell mumble practice needed. Well, it's not really the first spell, but... It is the first spell of the game, but not the first spell that I got, you know? Just because I don't do things in order. So, I gotta go back. I gotta go back. I gotta go back, 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 back. And now, we can now climb those hills as a spider. <laughs> I don't like these. The old spiders see your shorts and your backpack and you, they're, all, they're all jails and stuff. Which, yeah, it's a nice attention to needles. I, I can't... I can't get enough of these. So just gotta jump on those hills and then I have quite a quite a hard time. Here. I just gotta jump. And gotta make it, gotta make it. Oh, no. No, you don't. <laughs> Oh god. I'm gonna try to jump again. I swear these jumps sometimes are just. Oh, for God's sake! I swear these jumps sometimes. I swear you make it. You just swear you're gonna make it. And there's only. Nope. You can't do it. Again! Again! Did you see that? Ah. Uh. <laughs> But at this point, I just want things to get done and over with. And here we got another spider, and I think you can actually be hurt by spiders in your spider form. Which doesn't make sense though, but you will assume an immunity when you're a spider. Uh, it's just my way of thinking, is that, I mean, when, I don't know if it's true or not, but do you, does a, does a poisonous snake can be poisoned by another snake from his own poison or something that's just my way of thinking for me if 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 you're a hot hot guy or some if you're a creature that 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 lives in hot spots or something like this in a hot area I assume you're, you're immune to love and stuff and I will assume the same for the spider thing but we're at the top of Mumbles Mountain, and we're about to get the final jigsaw with the lovely jingle, which I love oh so much. So without further ado, here's the final jigsaw. So much lovable music in this game. I can't say this enough. And we're about to end this episode, but just before we do, we're just gonna backtrack a little bit. Just a little bit. And I'm not gonna try to female cry. Uh, my wish is not, it's not used to that quite yet. And now we can climb this hill, which I wanted to do all along to get this Jessa, which bothered me so much. And finally, we get it! That is amazing! <sighs> but anyway, guys, this is the end of this episode today, right here. And next time on the show, we're gonna do more. Alright? So, I hope I'll see you guys next time. And don't forget to leave suggestion, please. You want me to speed or something? Still, give me a suggestion. I mean, come on. Can't be, can't, can't be part of the community. You know, the more you're in, the more I'm in. So yeah. 
So, we're gonna see you next time for more Banjo Kazooie! And, I'll see you guys next time.